Hi there you guys, I'm Teddy from Bijuteo Beading and in this tutorial I'm gonna be showing you this beginners friendly and easy and fast to do cute little hearts for the Saint Valentine's. If you don't have much time to prepare, this one is great for you. Consider subscribing, with the bell, liking and sharing this video. In this way you motivate me to make more and more tutorials and uh, you could also check description for different useful resources and my Facebook page where you could share pictures of your work that you did following me. Thank you for being here. Now we'll start with the list of the materials. Okay guys, so what I'm using here for this tutorial are two colors of 11 o seed beads, silver and red. Here I'm also using six beads in 8 o size, again red color. These are rondelles, 4 by 6 millimeters, faceted crystals. These are earring findings, liver bags, and by the way, you could check description for a full list of materials, other useful links for my social networks, and you could see how you could support me in PayPal and also if you want to become a member of this channel. Anyways, here is a mount filament that is 0.006 inches or 0.15 millimeters. You could use other beading thread of your choice. This is size 10 beading needle and these are scissors. And now I'm going to take about half an arm span of thread on my needle and I'll be back. Okay guys, and I'm going to start my work by picking up three of these beautiful rondelles. And by the way, you need 10 for this project, five per earring. Okay, I'm picking them up. You see how beautiful they are. And I'm going to slide those down. I will stick my needle in my mat. And here, what I want to do is make a knot. And how I'm making it, I make a loop and I go twice through the loop I've made and I pull and then I make one more knot just to be sure it's all tight and secure. Here is what I have now and I'm going in this crystal and I want to pick up a seed bead, a NATO and a seed bead, okay and I go in the next crystal and here I'm going to just take an ato, go in the next crystal then another ato and go in the next crystal okay now I have this. Okay, and as I'm exiting here, I'm going to take one crystal and one silver seed bead. Okay, this is what I have. And I'm going to slide those beads down. Then in my next step, I'm skipping the, crystal, skipping the seed bead and going through the crystal. And then I go through the following crystal, just like this. And I'm going to pull gently. Here is what I have. Then uh, what I want to do is exit out of this crystal. And how I do this, I just go through all of the beads in this direction. And then here. Okay, now I'm exiting out of this crystal, only out of the crystal, not out of this seed bead here, only out of the crystal. Okay, and then I take a crystal and a seed bead again, slide those down like this then skip the seed bead move it like this and go backwards and through the crystal okay and when i pull i also have this crystal attached here you see what i have now 
Now in my next step I want to cut this tail thread here and what I want to do is that I'm going through this A2 in this direction. Okay, here I am and now I want to take seven silver beads. Okay, I have here my seven beads and as I'm exiting from this A2, I'm skipping the crystal and going through the following A2. Okay, this is what I have. Then what I want to take here are six silver beads. Okay, I have my six here. And I'm going through this one that is sticking out. Okay, here is what I do. Now I have this. And what I need to do next is take five silvers. Okay, I have five this time. And I'm going through this middle bead here. Okay, here it is. Then I'm going to repeat it, five and six. Okay, five. And I'm going through this silver here. And then I need six. Okay, six and go here. Now guys, what I want to do is go in this direction through three beads of my seven, if you remember, I added seven here. Okay. Okay, seven, six, five is what I added. Okay, and here I'm going through three of them. I'm skipping this one, not going through it and going through the following three. And also through the red one. Okay, this is what I do. Why I do this? Because in this way, when I pull, I want to make this bead in the center to pop out. If it doesn't pop out, just pull it like this and pull. Okay. Then go through all of the beads here in this direction. And through all of the beads here. And what I want to do is go also through the central bead here, then exit out of the next two silvers. Now I'm going to take three red beads, my earring finding, and three more red beads. Okay. So this is what I have, three earring finding three, and I'm going in the same place here through these two silvers and through the central one. Okay. What I need to do next, guys, is reinforce this joint. And how I do this, just go around in circle through all of those beads.
Okay, guys, and after I reinforce my heart, I'm here and I want to make a knot and cut my thread. And how I do this, I make here a loop and I go once, then I go second time through this loop I've made, and then I pull, and then I go through the following bead here. And what I do is that I cut this tail thread. And my cute little heart is ready. Okay guys, and now my cute little heart St. Valentine's project is ready. So if you like it, it's a good idea to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified for new tutorials. In this way, you motivate me to make more and more videos. You could also check description for full list of materials, Facebook page to share pictures of your creations that you did following me, link for PayPal donations, link to my second channel, and you will see what you get if you become a member of this channel. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you for liking, sharing and commenting. Bye bye from me.